channel. So today is a little mini vlog. Um, I'm going to be going to the store. I got up at 6 a.m. It is currently 7.38. So I'm gonna make some coffee and then I'm gonna work out. I wanted to show you guys how I make my coffee. Ever since I made this coffee, I don't go to Starbucks. I don't need to. So, if you want it hot, you can have it hot, but I like mine iced. I take whatever coffee you have. This is the caramel cookie Nespresso pod. But I like cold brew with it better, but you just pour it over ice. Like so. You're gonna take the silk caramel creamer. Shake it up, shake it up. Pour as much as you want. For the sake of this video, I'm not measuring, but I normally would. Let me get a spoon. said I usually measure but for right now I'm just gonna ooh, let's move this lid let's just caramel it up like that but last but not least sea salt you're gonna take a pinch of sea salt out of 10 it's creamy it's salty it's so good so i'm gonna finish this and then go work out and i'll catch you guys after Hey guys, so I figured I'll sit down and have a little chat with you guys. Got out the shower. <sighs> just moisturizing my face. I just want to talk to you guys about my wellness journey so far. So the last time I weighed in, I was around 243 and now I'm currently like 237. So, so roughly almost six pounds-ish, I would say. But yeah, so a little backstory on why I started this channel and talking about this as a wellness journey and not like a weight loss journey because I left a seven year relationship and I'm trying to find myself again. I've been very depressed. I lost myself between that relationship and it keeping me stuck. And I'm, I wasn't growing as a person. I was very detached from the world. I was depressed. I didn't really talk to no one, my, aside from my family, but like friends, I really didn't. And in that process, I started an Instagram and I kind of tracked my meals and, you know, I built a community there and I met friends and it really helped me. Um, but now I'm in my own place and I'm thriving. Okay, I lost six pounds. I started a YouTube channel. I'm back in school. Um, but yeah, between... My relationship and uh, finding out my daughter was diagnosed with severe autism, it was a lot on my mental health. So I'm really just trying to focus on becoming the best version of me. And so far this year, like I said, girl is thriving. We are thriving. Let me get my eyes so I can see you guys. 
but yeah um yeah i'm very proud of myself i lost my dad last year in may and i know he'll be proud of me too for making these steps and honestly at my breaking point in that relationship i prayed to my dad and i prayed to god and was like get me out of this if this is the end let it be the end but if it's not get me out of this and god came through and my dad been watching over me funny story this candle right here good morning dad it's my dad wrapped up in a candle and why I say funny story is because my dad always was known for wearing a red bandana, which I have right here. And for the longest time, when I missed him, I would put it and try to smell of his scent and I could never get the scent. Like my memory, it wouldn't bring it back. And I remember crying over it for so long. And then when I was shopping for my apartment one day, my mom was like, go to the candle section. Just go to the candle section. Mind you, I have so many candles. Why do I need more candles? Who knows? <laughs> but I went and I saw these candles. And I bought like three of them. And I don't know why I bought three. I just bought three. Checked out. And then I threw the bag in the back of my seat, like back seat of my car. And like I forgot about it. That's how much stuff I was buying, um, and I just wasn't, yeah, I wasn't keeping track of anything. So when I was picking up my daughter, I reached in the back, and I went through it, and was like, what did I buy? Then I go and smell that candle, and I just started bawling my eyes out, because it's my dad's scent. The scent I've been looking for since he's been gone, and now I keep it. I'll show you guys I keep it on this little thingy that's my dad and then that's the candles and that's me and my dad on our birthday we share the same birthday so I just wanted to share that story with you guys I miss your dad I really do but yeah, I'm not going to do any makeup today. I just moisturize my face. I'm going to brush my hair, let it air dry. And then I'm going to get dressed and head on out to do this grocery shopping because I am a little late. It's 9.15, so I want to get there by 10. Hopefully earlier than that so I can get the shopping done, come back. Because I got to pick my daughter up at 3. And then she has ABA therapy for two hours. So... I'll catch you guys when I'm in the car on my way to Ralph's. I wasn't into Trader Joe's, but I like just going to one store and getting everything that I need. And Trader Joe's, I only go for certain things. But yeah, okay. I'm talking too much. I'll see you guys in a bit. look really good they're nice and fat 
I like when they're like that because the skin is so easy to peel. So, got those. And then I got some baby spinach. I have some in the freezer, but I always like to stock up. So I have plans for this, but the rest I don't use, I always put in the freezer. Then I got some cold brew. I have Nespresso pods, but when I want like an iced coffee, I like to just do cold brew. And then when I want just a hot, I'll do the Nespresso. One day. And I got some strawberries. Strawberries are so expensive right now. Um, it's crazy. These are not organic and they were the same price normally organic is, but my daughter loves strawberries, so I had to get them. And I got some grape tomatoes. And then I got some eggs. Always gotta have eggs on hand. I got some Yazzo bars for myself. Some pickles. This brand. Rillos, I think that's how you say it. These are my favorite, you know, because I'm from Jersey, so I love a good pickle, and these are as close as I can get to a good quality pickle out here in SoCal. I got some uh, turkey pepperoni. This whipped cream is always in stock in this house. My daughter loves to eat this with crackers or bagels. Like bagels are her favorite. And I got some Swiss and Gruyere cheese blend. I've had this before. I made this in a quiche Lorraine for class assignment. And it was like so good. So I wanted to get it again. Some reduced fat feta. Whipped cream for my coffees. Some unsalted butter. And some ice cream sandwiches for my kiddo. She's been on a kick with these ice cream sandwiches. So I saw them, they were mini. I was like, so cute. So I got them for her. And then, I think like two weeks ago, I found Annie's waffles. These are the birthday cake ones, but I tried the strawberry shortcake ones and they were delicious. They were so good. They taste like a strawberry strudel. So I was like, yes, they're coming home with me. Even though they're from my kiddo, I like to just, you know, buy fun things for her. Of course I'm gonna try it too, but I thought they were fun. And then I saw Jabani had this white chocolate raspberry and this salted caramel coffee. And they were like new releases. This is like a spring batch and this is a limited batch. And I always try these when they come out and I'm so excited because I do make my salted caramel coffees like I showed you guys earlier. But this one is actually a creamer. So I'm really excited for that and the white chocolate raspberry which is my favorite drink at starbucks the white mocha with raspberry so right on the money for me <laughs> and i just got some chicken thighs why is my cheese wrapped and not my meat uh, i don't know then i got some Extra sharp cheddar cheese block. Um, let me wash my hands because they unwrap my meat and put my cheese in the bag. I don't know. All right, moving on. I got two things of kale. Of kale, um, some green onion, and 
organic uh, English cucumber, two lemons, some um, uncured pepper salami. I saw a lot of YouTubers eat this, like they put it in like a little snack box. So I wanted to try it out, it was on sale. So I was like, why not? And then I just ran out of maple syrup. So I got this one. It's like a light pepper one. Some olives. Some fettuccine pasta. One red bell pepper. And here's the other kale. And then they had these turmeric cold pressed juices on sale for like three something. They're normally like seven dollars. So I had to get them. Like I've been really, every time I go to Rouse, I look for these because they're so good. And I was like, um, 337 because they're about to go they're about to expire on the 21st of this month but i'll drink these like in the next two days like this is so good it's um urban remedy and it has orange carrot lemon and turmeric and i love it it's so good that's the only one i tried other ones but i didn't like them this is the only one i like and I got some organic jasmine rice. I have one bag from the Trader Joe's brand um, in the freezer, but I need to stock up one more. I used to always make my own rice, you know, from like dry rice and make it. Um, but now that I got a microwave, I'm like, throw it in there. <laughs> throw it in. And I just got some uh, rigatoni tricolor. So if you can kind of get a gist of what I, my ideas for this week, I'm definitely making a pasta salad. I got some Italian dressing. This Old Hot Ranch for my daughter. She loves ranch, obsessed with it. I'm not really, really, not really into it. Um, and then I got some pancake mix because my daughter loves breakfast. I always got to have breakfast foods on one hand. She's very picky, but breakfast she'll eat a lot of. That is got, you know, fair life milk. These animal style chicken nuggets. These are my daughter's favorite. I get them every time I go grocery shopping. She loves these. And they're really good because they're made with like real chicken and organic so good so I got them from her. and I just got some breakfast sausage and breakfast bacon and that is all thank you guys for watching please like this video and subscribe I would love to have you guys here and if you like this content I'm gonna keep it coming so, yeah, so I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.